Okay, so Riaz is asking that whether we need to supplement sodium bicarbonate uh, if the pH is less than 7.1 or the bicarb levels are 3. So understand that why we need to supplement bi sodium bicarbonate, why they are important. So sodium bicarbonate or soda bicarb acts like a buffer in the blood to maintain the internal milieu, the pH of the human body so that the uh, uh, me uh, hemostasis is maintained. Now if the bicarb levels are very low or if the pH is very low, ultimately they will cause bready arrest or cardiac decomposition. So we need to maintain them to a certain level. So again, we are not talking about the specific indications like TCA poisoning, rhabdomyolysis or others. We are just discussing that if you see an ABG, this is the pH level and this is the bicarb level, whether you need to supplement or not. So there is no specific guidelines, but there is a good article on PubMed in 2019, which it's a systemic review, which concluded from 18 trials and studies and said that if the pH is less than 7.1 or the bicarb levels are less than 6, you need to supplement it. For cardiac, uh, cardiovascular stability, at least 8 to 10 millimoles of bicarb levels should be maintained in the blood gas. So do read this article. Thank you.